Hello students, welcome to Ishwari Tariksha channel. So how are you all? So today in this video students we are going to see very quickly the counselling process for KEA NEET. Students the counselling process for KEA NEET and KCET are different. That is engineering counselling is different from MBBS counselling. So in this video we are going to see about KEA NEET counselling. A separate video for KCET counselling I will be posting later. So students if you see in KEA NEET counselling totally there will be 3 rounds. Round 1, Round 2 and third round is called as mop up round. So if you see in Round 1 if a seat is allotted to you. So you have uh, if a seat is allotted to you you have 4 options. If a seat is not allotted then you can directly go to Round 2. Suppose a seat is allotted to you there are 4 choices. Choice 1, choice 2, choice 3, choice 4. If you select choice 1, meaning is you can join the college. Pay the fees and go and report to the college. So that is joining the college, choice 1. Choice 2 meaning is you are holding the college and then you are going to the second round. So students make a note here, you have to pay the fees in this round itself. If you select choice 2. And then if you select choice 3, meaning is you are cancelling the seat. You don't want that seat. So you are cancelling that seat and you can go to the next round. That is you can participate in round 2. Suppose if you select choice 4, meaning is you are exiting from the counselling. Students uh, be careful here. Exit meaning is you are not uh, exiting only from this round. Exiting meaning is you are coming out of counselling itself. So you are not going to participate in KEA need counselling. That is the meaning of choice 4. Exit means you are coming out of counselling. So this is about first round. So first round if you want to go to second round how you can go is if a seat is not allotted to you you will go to second round you can hold the seat and then go to second round holding the seat meaning is you are paying the fees and then you are going to the second round third uh, third option is if you cancel the seat also you can go and participate in the second round then in the second round students Again, if a seat is allotted to you, what is your option? And if a seat is not allotted, we will see. If a seat is not allotted to you in second round, then you can participate in mop-up round. So students here note down that if you want to participate in mop-up round, you, uh, you shouldn't have allotted seat in round 1 and round 2. In round 1 also, a uh, seat is not allotted to you. In round 2 also a seat is not allotted to you. Only then you can participate in mop up round. Suppose a seat is allotted to you. Here there are no 4 choices. Choices will not be given. Either you have to join the college or you have to cancel the seat. So if you are cancelling the seat there is penalty for that. So it is better if you get a, a seat in uh, round 2 you have to go and join the college and students about mop up round a detailed video I will be posting later so know the detail completely about mop up round so all the very best students if you have any doubt you can write in the comment box I will meet you in the next video students